We're back where we started. Uh, look! It's the primal lens. Did it activate? Don't ask me. This is it, right? Did we find... Look sharp! Let's do this! We're no match for it! Run, Sane! I'll hold it off. Don't be a fool! I'm in command here, it should be me who stays! I can't let you do that! You've got a big future ahead of you! As to you! Up, boys, stand your ground. Y yes, ma'am. What are you doing here? Little early to be calling a retreat, Lieutenant. The cavalry has arrived. Are you all right, Lieutenant? Hey, kiddo. Hey, a blondie. Which one of you ordered a hero? Because she's here. A hero. Hero win. Cheap. Arm up! We'll show this monster that flesh and blood are more powerful than stone! Ready to teach this thing a lesson, Sane? I'm ready.
happen on the battlefield. If you want to survive, be ready to adapt. Damn right. Take what you're thrown and turn it to your advantage. Mercs don't have to play it by the book. Wise words. I'll have to remember that. Take what you're thrown. Maybe we could use the rubble to take cover. Thanks! Shut up! Let's! Swords! 
Something's happening. We might be able to use the rubble. like that hide behind the rubble it's the only way Care of that. This was a valuable experience. Got him. <laughs> you sure it's a he? That was a rune golem. They've been sighted before at other barrows. Guys, guys, guys! Come look at this! It's so big, and so bright, and so... Yeah! So this is the mother load, huh? I know folks say rune lenses are condensed magic, but I don't know what this is. Imagine wielding it. No, it's likely too much for one person to contain. There's your mission accomplished, Leanne. We have what we came for. doubts about the League and Empire working together and stuff, but we pulled it off, <laughs> yep! She's right. This victory belongs to all of us. Well said. This discovery is a symbol of newfound friendship between the Empire and the League. Let us remember it always. Then we are agreed. The disputed Norse Farian territory will be ceded to the Empire. In return, the Empire will pay annual compensation to the League Council for a period of ten years. Done! I welcome this graceful solution to another of our long-standing problems. This is truly a joyous day, gentlemen. On behalf of the League and the Monarchy of Norrister, I praise you for your tireless work, Dukes. 
you have Eucharist's thanks as well. How marvelous that peace between us will be sustained. Unless the esteemed General Goldwyn plans to hang up his uniform, I wouldn't dream of quarreling with the Empire. Nor I with you, King Valmoris. We all know the ferocity of Kanani warriors, and I fear I would be outmatched. Hear, hear. Today's meeting has been an excellent demonstration of what we might accomplish together. If I may, Dukes Aldrich. Hmm? Groom's daughter, was it? Periel Groom, your grace. Such an honor to meet you. Periel, you're, uh, you're an adjunct, so you're only here to facilitate. Quite so. And as such, I would like to facilitate a discussion about why, after giving the Galdian Empire the primal lens we found half a year ago, we've received no reports as to how the research is progressing. And perhaps I might also facilitate an explanation as to why they haven't paid their share of the costs. <laughs> I'd heard that Count Groom's heir was sharp as attack and twice as prickly. And I see the rumors are true. My apologies, Miss Groom. The Primal Lens is a rare artifact. Even the Empire has never seen its like. As such, its study is taking longer than we initially anticipated. However, you have my assurances that we will respect your contributions and share our findings as soon as possible. I will also ensure you receive payment by the time you depart. I believe you're staying with us a few days longer. Indeed, Your Grace. It's a beautiful city, and I was hoping to explore it. Also, it's Countess Groom. Not miss. Ariel, no. <laughs> My deepest apologies, dear Countess. I pray you enjoy the rest of your stay in Galdea. Please, don't ever do that again, milady. Oh, thought my heart might stop. They asked me to facilitate. I facilitated. You demanded, milady, and to Dukes Aldrich, no less. The man whose influence in the Empire surpassed only by the Emperor himself. I'm well aware, Jenquis. I simply don't like the man. What do you mean? The Dukes has gone out of his way to make peace with us. That Norsefaria purchase gives him Fort Atlas, which is the perfect foothold for invading League lands. And he got it for a song, especially when compared to taking it the hard way. Also... Also? I can't stand his smug face. Anyway, enough of that. We're going out tonight. So long as I'm here, I intend to sample Galdia's finest. Very good, milady. I hear tell of a regional speciality where they melt the cheese just so, and... new guy. Getting used to the watch? Uh, <laughs> I've been at it for half a year. Two days less than you, remember? Ha, what a kidder. 
Anyway, I'm gonna head over to the mess hall. Not like we got anything better to do these days. Well, she never changes. Ah, Noah. Perfect timing. Gotta talk to you. What is it? As I'm sure you know, the watch has got a pretty high turnover. People come, people go, and they all got their reasons. Heck, even Mimi took off. Went south to you, Chris, on some kind of warrior journey or whatever. That's why I want you to take my place as captain for a while. While I'm not planning to up and vanish anytime soon, I think it'd be good practice. Yeah, it'll be good. Wait, what? You're making Noah the acting captain? I've got seniority by two days. You should have asked me. I did ask you. You said, and I quote, that sounds like a pain in the butt. Sounds like me, all right. Fine then, Noah. I officially dubbed thee acting captain. Well, Noah, what you say? Sure, I'll do it. See, decisive. That's what I like about you. Now, for your first assignment, let's go tell Emir what's going on. Need something? I'm gonna be letting Noah take over as captain for a while. You would do that to me. Did it ever occur to you that I might have my own plans for how to allocate our resources? Why it's my job to create order out of this shoddy ragtag outfit is beyond me. I'd quit on the spot if it weren't for her ladyship. Hey, it is what it is. Going forward, Noah chooses our teams. And if you catch wind of any jobs, you set him up. Jobs? Oh, there's no shortage of those. I thought the Watch was created as a reserve force to assist the standing army in times of crisis, but it seems I was mistaken. Because the rest of the land clearly sees us as some kind of glorified errand runners. Ah, oh, why me? Why? Why? Right then. What sort of job would please the Watch's finest? Tiger hunting! Not listed. Wolf hunting! Anything related to hunting, not listed. However, the Watch is shorthanded. If you meet anyone gullible enough, <laughs> capable enough, then kindly recruit them. Can I trust you with that, oh great captain? Just Noah is fine. <laughs> Don't let me down, oh mighty captain. If you bring home recruits, I'll consider letting you thicken out your team. In the meantime, I can't spare anyone. Count me in! You need me, kiddo. Say no more.
To see you. Do come again whenever you need to lie down. Hurry. Hey, you wouldn't happen to know the way to Red Throat Ridge, would you? Supposedly it's east of here? Help a girl out? Well, um, you've got the direction right. Yes! All right, evildoer. Here comes Magical Girl Malore, ready to dole out equal helpings of love and justice. Thanks, mister. I don't know, but I got so caught up in it that I didn't think to stop her. We can't let a little kid wander into Red Throat Ridge alone. Come on.
there she is. Um, excuse me, Mr. Soldier? Hmm? What's the matter? Could you tell me which way is east? I'm trying to get to Red Throat Ridge. Oh, well, that's, uh... Got it, thanks! Okay, Malor, back to work. No rest for the righteous. She's on the move again. We'd better hurry. Exercise. I feel stronger. Greetings. I've got a number of pelts for sale today. Can I interest you? Uh... You know, I don't think we've met before. The name's Kuroto, and I'm a hunter by trade. This here crossbow's been my partner for longer than I care to remember. Together, we can snipe with more accuracy than any elf. That's quite a claim. Wait. Yeah, I smell it now. You're trying to achieve something great, aren't you? Uh... I've been at this for a long time, and it's given me a keen sense of smell. There's not much that gets past me. The truth is, I'm seeking new companions to fight in my side. Of course you are. And here's the part where you tried to win me over, right? Another tried before, years ago. But if you're thinking to impress me with a show of prowess, think again. There's not a man or woman alive who can match me with a crossbow. Let's say I wanted to impress you anyway. Hmm. If you're that determined, you must have a good reason. How's this? Hunt me three wild boars. You'll find some in Redthroat Ridge to the east.
Stop resisting, bandit! For the last time, I'm not a bandit! I'm a desperado! It's the same thing. Damn it! I didn't attack your stupid village! It's true! I came from a place where you rode your bronc like the wind, and sometimes you did bad stuff. But I'm done with that life! What's going on here? Nothing that concerns you, Bob. So unless you want to get dragged into this, I suggest you keep walking. Yeah, I don't think I can do that. Why is this guy under suspicion? Are you kidding me? Look at how he's dressed! He couldn't be any more suspicious! Oh yeah, great sleuthing, Inspector Dumbface! I wear these duds because they were a gift for my desperado brothers. I'd rather die than change out of them. It does seem like you're accusing him based on how he looks. I'm not taking any chances. Bandits have been raiding our villages near the Imperial border. Didn't you hear? I can't believe you would accost somebody like this based on how they're dressed. Let me take it from here. And who are you supposed to be? I'm Noah, from the Eltis Vice Watch. Oh, you're one of her ladyships. Fine. If you think you know so much better, you handle him. We don't need the trouble anyway. What do you think you're doing? It's okay. You can trust me. You said you didn't attack the village, right? <laughs> Finally, someone with ears! I don't know what's wrong with you that you defend this guy. If anything bad happens, it's on you. Yep, got it. On me. Don't make me regret this. Thanks for the save, man. You're one upstanding guy. This has got to be fate or something. What do you say you let me join up with you? I came here to do big things. And I mean big. Big in what way? Big in a big way? What kind of question is that? The name's Yusuke. 
You're looking at one of the world's future titans. We're gonna make waves together, boss. I just know it! Welcome to the ranks. See, this guy knows what he's talking about. Piece of me! Step on up!
A piece of me? Step on up! his exercise.
his exercise. Piece of me, step on up. That doesn't even count as exercise. I'm a freaking legend.
Yes! I've got him now. He must have thought he was pretty slick holding up in a place like this. But there's no pulling the wool over the eyes of justice! Magical girl Malor sees all! Huh? Who are you? Hey, wait a second. You look kind of shady. Are you bad guys or something? Well, guess what? You're about to see the error of your ways! What? I'm not shady! Nobody disturbs the peace on my watch! By the light of my guiding rune, and in the name of love and justice too, Magical Girl Malore is coming to get ya! Oh no, you have gotta be... Take no prisoners! Magical Cutie Missile! Oops, sorry. I thought for sure you were villains. That's what I get for judging a book by its cover. I won't make that mistake again. Do I really look that shady? Yeesh. So, what brings you out here? Oh, well, we ran into you back in Elta's Vice. You mentioned Redthroat Ridge, and I thought, that's not good. This used to be a bandit stronghold, and there are dangerous creatures on the prowl, too. Trust me, I did a job here once. It's no place for a kid. So, you came all the way out here to stop me, even though you don't even know my name? Actually, you've shouted your name like seven times now, so I think I've got that. Okay, well that settles it then. You must be a good person. So, tell me about this group you're in, the Watch. Is it some kind of super justice squad? Sure, let's go with that. So, in other words... What you're suggesting is that we team up and fight evil! Magical Girl Malor meets Noah's Super Squad! It's bold. I like it! What? No, I'm here to talk you out of this. There's a real nasty monster holed up in this pass. And I'm not talking the garden variety. It's packing some seriously dangerous magic. If we don't stop it, something awful is bound to happen. And you were planning to face it alone? Hey, I wouldn't be much of a magical girl if I wasn't ready to get knocked down a few times. But I always pick myself right back up. <sighs> All right, you win. We'll help you take down the monster. Yes! Love and justice, your new tag team is here! Let's get this show on the road. By the rune's guiding light, the magical girl Malor is coming to get ya! Magical cutie missile! Magical missile! That's what you get!
let's get it done! Let's do this! Let's get it done! Still no sign of it. Are you sure this magic packing super monster is even real? Of course I'm sure. The intel came straight from one of my old comrades in arms. Wait, so it was your idea to investigate this? No one asked you? Well, technically no. But it's a magical girl's duty to smack the bad guys up with love and justice before they become a menace. Seems a little presumptuous. So what? 
It might be a thankless job, but somebody's got to do it. And hey, who are you to talk about being presumptuous? Uh... Nobody asked you to follow me all the way out here, Mr. Worrywart. But you did, didn't you? And that's why I knew at first glance that you were a good guy. Actually, you called me shady and... Now get a move on, Noah. Love and justice aren't gonna dish themselves out. <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to Lean. Let's do this! Uh-oh. I'm picking up some serious magic. You think it's our target? Oh, I know it's our target. Eh? 
It's go time, Noah. You remember how this works? Don't worry. I learn fast. Any monster that threatens the peace is in for a stomping. By the light of my guiding rune, and by the power of love and justice, magical girl Malor is coming to get ya! Evil doesn't stand a chance against the forces of good. By the light of my guiding rune, warrior of the Watch Noah is coming to get ya! Did I do it right? And this is where I bust out my secret weapon! Magical pretty grimoires! What are those two books? They're grimoires, Noah, and they help magical girls like me dole out justice! Okay, but why are there two? Pick the one closest to the monster. It's as simple as that. I don't think it is, though. Oh, come on, Noah. Believe in yourself, and justice will find a way. Huh? Where'd it go? Trust your gut. Pick a book, and let's hope justice is on our side. How you like this? Oh, get him! Magical, lovely justice hammer! Listen to the whispers of justice! What does that even mean?
see how you like this. Go get him! Magical lovely justice hammer! Bob doesn't have time for bad guys, and that means you! Here you go! Can you stand? My Thanks. turn! You like this? Go get him! Magical lovely justice hammer! Bob doesn't have time for bad guys, and that means you! Lens! Oh. Oh. Here you go! Can you stand? See how you like this. Go get him! Magical lovely justice hammer! Listen to the whispers of justice! What does that even mean? Yeah. Here you go! Can you stand? Thanks!
see how you like this. Oh, get him. Magical, lovely justice hammer. <laughs> Love doesn't have time for bad guys, and that means you. There you go. This. Can you stand? Damn it. Like this up for size! Oh, Adam, magical, lovely justice hammer! Listen to the whispers of justice! What does that even mean? Here you go! Can you stand? Thanks! Yeah. So, uh, we done here? Yep! Grimoire's deployed, monster destroyed! And now folks out there don't have to worry about a torrent of evil magic wrecking their day. You did good, Noah. Thanks. <laughs> Happy to be of service. So, here's an idea. Why don't we keep this tag team going? Except I'll help you now. It's only fair. Seriously? Yeah! You know, assuming your super squad at the watch has room for one more. You never know when a magical girl is just what the situation ordered. Well, if you're really sure. Totally! When justice calls, I'm there. So, can I ask you something? Sure, what? What exactly is a magical girl, and how is it different from a mage? Oh my gosh, are you kidding? They're like night and day. A magical girl is like one part love and one part justice, and do you want to write this down? <laughs> 